The fire chief in Coventry is off the job. The central Coventry fire chief has suddenly retired less than two weeks after the district filed for bankruptcy. NBC 10's Brian Crandall has that story. Central Coventry Fire Chief Andrew Baines is out as the embattled district now goes through bankruptcy. The state official who's overseeing the district, Revenue Director Rosemary Booth Gologli, says Baines retired effective immediately, though she had first told me earlier that Baines was put on paid leave. Baines told me over the phone that he was called into a meeting Monday morning and decided to retire as a result of that meeting. He did not want to elaborate and said he wanted to talk to his lawyer first, but he was critical of Gologli and her team. Gologli didn't want to say much about it either, but Baines's replacement was announced already by the evening. Retired Hudson, New Hampshire chief Sean Murray had apparently been lined up for at least a few days. So Chief Baines told today you're being replaced. Uh, chief Baines submitted his resignation today. Um, I have not told him who his replacement is. From the Firefighters Union president. What I understand is Chief Baines really wouldn't do what they were asking him to do because he didn't think a lot of the things were, were safe. Meanwhile, the main thrust of the meeting here was to update taxpayers on the move to file for bankruptcy in the district that's been facing financial problems for a couple years now. Bankruptcy is something many taxpayers had called for a while ago. Just so the firemen can have their jobs and go on with it and so can the people. By filing for bankruptcy, the state overseers can shelve the firefighters' contract, and they are making changes. Firefighters will now work more hours per week. They'll pay 20% of their health insurance, get half as many holidays. It'll be harder to get overtime, and two firefighters will be laid off. Uh, we're prepared to fight this as, as much as we have to. Do you think what's in there is fair to the firefighters at this point? Yeah, I think um, it's what's needed to get balanced. And so the union says it'll challenge the plan in court. Meanwhile, that new chief, his position here is only temporary. I'm Brian Crandall, NBC 10 News in Coventry.